Sifu and Josh Vitel squeeze in a morning meeting and playtime as they push Sun Quinn on their backyard swing set. They just found out they got a spot when their daycare reopens on Monday. The juggling act of keeping your business going and your house clean and keeping a child happy. And who's the lion? Boxes taking over our house. Carolyn and Josh co-own Duckish. Right now they work in split shifts from their home office setup. Duckish is a natural line of body and lip balms and their very first product, their diaper rash stick. From their kitchen, Carolyn packs bath bombs to ship out. I've also seen a huge uptick in things like bath products because people are at home and self-care is a huge, it was a huge trend before, but it's especially a huge trend now because people are doing anything they can to stay sane. The bath bombs are a big seller, but it's this. They're all natural body bomb sticks that have been a hit. A lot of people washing their hands, especially frontline staff. Hands are ruined. Lotion is in, uh, a hot commodity these days. Last winter, Ducky started selling online, something other businesses had to scramble to set up. Amazon carries their line, and so does Whole Foods in Ontario, plus many local stores in Nova Scotia. But then, along came a giant. Sophie's is a huge deal for us. It's by far our biggest customer so far. 160 Sobeys and Foodlands across the Maritimes have put duckish on their shelves. They had a big stockpile of product pre-COVID, which has kept them operational. But to meet the growing demand, they need to find a new production space. The trend towards buying local with natural ingredients is growing. A strange thing to have your products needed in a time like this, but at the same time, it's great that we're able to provide something that gives people some relief. Uh, and that serves a, a, a real purpose right now for, uh, for people, both, you know, both frontline people uh, who wash their hands constantly and, and need the products and people at home too. Their little stick has struck a chord and they hope maybe this giant retailer can make duckish mainstream.